Hello, Fred. 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 Hello, we are going to jump in for yet another run on the good old new save file. Um, who we got some stuff to do as Beast as Keeper seems fun. Let's go for that. We've, we're, we're really nearing the end now. It's only really the problem characters that we've got a lot of marks left with. And, and by problem, I mean characters that like cause issues in terms of like lag and stuff. Like um, Eve, Tainted Eve is, is one of them that I might not even do on video because the runs are just so laggy. It's kind of not fun. Um, <laughs> so we'll, we'll see about that. We'll see. But anyways, how is everybody on this fine, fine day? Uh, my question of the day is, what's bothering you right now? Like, literally right now, what is bothering you? Because something's always bothering people, and I'd like to know. Receive for the room, Isaac's tears are replaced by a throwable knife. It just gives you mom's knife for the room. That's actually going to be pretty decent for our boss. We can, uh... Hold on to that one. Some of these, um, some of these community remix cards are like really goddamn good. Okay, nice. But yeah, good old keeper. Don't push my coin around, big sir. Big sir, excuse me. They're pushing my coin around like crazy here. I think that's rude. I think that is rude. Um, and we start. Oh, Lord, you're really gonna do this to me. Okay. I see how it is. <laughs> I see how it is. Oh my goodness, okay. I, I mean, I love this item, but on this character, maybe not the best idea, but it, it, it's actually a pretty significant fire rate increase, so there's that at least. There's that. Good, good. We'll crack that open. Oh, the money just keeps rolling in this floor. Let's uh, see what our shop's got on offer. Anything tasty? Unfortunately, not. Um, we don't have another bomb for grabbing that, which is a little unfortunate. We'll see if we get a bomb from the boss. I don't even know how Mom's Knife will react with this, so I'm going to try it and just see if it even does anything. It doesn't. Okay, I, I kind of had a feeling it might not. A little bit of a shame, but understandable nonetheless. There you go, big boy. Just a look upgrade from this, nothing more. Um, and we shall, we shall go. This is, this is already wacky. We're doing beast, aren't we, at the moment? Yeah, beast, so we can just kind of carry on the regular path. How have people been enjoying the Isaac series recently? It seems to be doing a little bit better after the, uh, new year, especially considering January is normally a pretty bad month for YouTube. Um, it's nice to see that this, this, uh, series is doing pretty well recently. Like, I wouldn't say extremely well, but definitely on, on par to where it should be sort of thing. And that's, that's always nice to see. And I'm hoping... Post January, we'll see some um, some more resurgence of the series and see some stuff go on. Uh, what the hell's this? Plus five bombs allows Isaac to hold their bombs and throw them by holding down the bomb button. There's quite a number of items that, that add the ability to throw your bombs um, in the game. I don't know if I want to go for that just because I can I can save some money up and buy a devil deal. Um, honestly, this this item might be significantly better for this character. Here's some bombs. Do we have plus five bombs for that? Yes, we do. Nugget bombs are pretty good. Throwable nugget bombs kind of interesting, but I feel like the throwable bombs are only good if you have like a pretty, I won't say unlimited source, but you have like a pretty healthy source of bombs, which we, we kind of don't right now. Obviously, we've got bombs, but we don't have like a constant income. Hello, good fella. I will bomb you guys. That is contraband. Unfortunately, contraband we cannot take because um, it will... Uh, it will unfortunately replace our active item, which I think is just a horrible, horrible, horrible mistake if I uh, if I went for that, but we can only wish. Unfortunately, we didn't get the, the, the small contraband, which gives you one item. We got the big one. Dude, the money right now is just amazing. Also, yeah, this is this is genuinely like so strong. Like, I, I did not expect this item also, my Apple of Pride. That might have been part of the reason this was so strong, actually. I kind of forgot I had my Apple of Pride on. Um, but this is so good. Like, the uh, the ability to just create these swarms of tears and run them into enemies is a little harder to be accurate and sort of, you have to time it right, but we're able to kill stuff so easily. I mean, Rogue Planet could genuinely be a big issue, but I think when it's adding this much fire rate, it's, it's, it's pretty good. Also, it allows us to uh, easily use spectral tears to... Uh, to best some of these enemies. There you go, look at that, baby. Okay, it'd be real, real nice if we could get up to 30 cent before um, 
before doing the boss fight. Just to make sure if there is a 30 cent item in the devil deal, we can afford it. Because that has happened to me on occasion as this guy, and it's, it's always depressing when uh, you can't reach it. Now, there is two pennies here, but is it really worth two bombs for two pennies? I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to take an executive decision and say yes, it is. Just because I feel like it's... It's quite important if there's a 30 cent item that we're able to afford it. It could massively increase the potency of our run. Uh, yeah, what have people been up to recently? I think I sent, mentioned in my last Isaac episode that I was making um, I was making homemade pizza for my sister and her boyfriend, and it went extremely well. It's my first time making that recipe, and they ended up being very, very good. Quite, quite low calorie, but like still like really crispy, and I loaded mine with toppings, and oh, beautiful stuff. Beautiful stuff. And today... I think we're off out with some friends. I have no idea where at the moment. Ooh. We get ourselves a gulpy gulpy, which isn't honestly great, because it's literally that's all we get out of it, but hey her. And then in here, we did not get a 30 cent item. Unfortunately, we got two items that I'm not particularly fond of, to be honest. That's a bit of a shame. Um Yeah, I'm, I'm just gonna leave that. That, that. that that that's a big shame of a devil deal right there. That was quite a swing and a miss. Quite a swing and a miss. I did uh, recently. I, I so, someone. I had someone recently commenting on some of my really old Isaac episodes. It'd be interesting to know, like, what do, if any of you remember what was the first Isaac episode, or maybe even episode you watched on my channel. What was what was the video that pulled you in? <laughs> why why are you still here today? Um, be interesting to know. But um, I saw a guy that had been watching my um my my really old Isaac series, like Afterbirth plus Isaac. Um. And it was really interesting to listen to some of my commentary because I used to like I used to do this thing which I I do think I should try and do a little more but I think I was try harding it a bit much back then. I used to try my absolute hardest to not talk about the game to make sure I was always like talking or, or telling stories and stuff. And while I think that is fun and like that does interject some personality and stuff. Um Okay, I see how this works. Um unfortunate uh, well, that is fun. I do think it interjects some personality and stuff. I feel like I was forcing it a bit too hard and I was just like like telling random stuff just for the sake of telling it rather than it being like a good story or it being like relevant to what I was talking about. Nowadays, I try to like give a, a pretty a pretty decent mix of the two so that there's a good bit of like Isaac commentary for people that just are just here to sort of watch more Isaac. Ooh, these are both really good. Humbling Bundle, of course, is fantastic. Um, and... That is pretty... I'm going to buy both of these. I realise that leaves us less money for a devil deal should we get one soon, but I really like um, George here. I think it's called, isn't it? Uh, and Humbling Bundle, obviously, is just going to pay dividends later on. Um, but yeah, I, th I feel like there's plenty of people that are here just because they enjoy Isaac and modded Isaac, and there's probably also plenty of people here because they just like some chill commentary while there's Isaac on in the background. I don't, don't like the hit you just got on me there, good sir. Oh, my goodness. I need to be careful. I need to be very, very careful. Hey, that helps. <laughs> that helps. Also, I think Humbling Bundle will affect the pennies spawned by Wooden Nickel, I think. So that's kind of nice. On occasion, that'll be useful. I don't know why that guy was charmed. Oh, uh, does, this, does this little dude charm? Okay, he charms and then blows up. That's kind of interesting. Uh, we'll go straight for the boss here. Actually, no, no, no. I should try and get a little bit more money in case we do get a devil deal. Just in case. Um... Either way. But yeah, like, I, I feel like that's like an evolution of like, before I was making content and I was like really sort of thinking about it and trying like commentary wise, I think I was trying to mimic Northern Lion as much as I possibly could at the time, which is not exactly a bad thing because obviously he is an, an, an excellent content creator and obviously his Isaac content was the bomb. Um, but I, I don't feel like I need to do that really. Um... I feel like I can sort of stand on my own two feet now and, and have my own flavor sort of thing. Ooh, wow. Do we get... That might be one of the most depressing things to ever happen in my entire life. I, I knew... The thing is, in the, in, the, in the subconscious of my mind, I knew that could happen and I just forgot. I knew that if you got a fading chest and you got an item out of it, it could still fade away. I should have just ran it in. Oh, that is... Got terror. Terror randomly out of a goddamn stone chest. 
Man. That's a damage down, like, damage up that we really needed and, like, being able to destroy rocks easily. That's depressing. <laughs> that's that's a real square kick in the nards right there. My god. That one hurts. I'm going to need a really good boss item to make me feel better. Or a devil deal that is stupendously amazing. Because that is the biggest kick I've ever felt. Oh, dude, my god. He shoots the balls at us in a minute, doesn't he? You stop doing that, my good sir. There you go, there's the balls. Yeah, that was that was truly, truly something I I cannot fathom as uh how unfortunate it was. <laughs> I've had it happen with other items, but never never quite an item like terror. Getting terror out of a chest. I mean it, it's thematic, but that's kind of overpowered to be able to get out of there. Let me get this, which isn't great. We did get an angel deal, however. Okay. It's all fine now. It's all fine. Who gives a shit? <laughs> The game, the game was like, I see you. I see your issues. I see your problems. I mean, it still would have been nice to have terror on top of this, but this makes me feel a lot better about what just happened. Especially considering we were unlikely to get an angel or devil deal there, and we got an angel deal. I think this is my first run getting Godhead after having unlocked it, you know. Also, Godhead is real good with this setup with Rogue Planet, I think. Because we've got this, like, swarm. If we could get piercing, it would be... Oh boy. It would be absolutely insane but yeah having the herming on top of this is really nice but then on top of that we've got the um just the aura spinning around us which is really nice we got ourselves the toy drum get our red rooms from george toy drum we're not going to take at the moment because we are still in our chances of getting another angel slash devil deal that i would probably like to grab Beautiful stuff. The Herming does kind of give us extra range as well, really. Uh, whenever you take damage trigger an animation where you lay on the floor crying, shooting tears in all directions, you cannot take damage during this animation. This could be interesting. It's also a tears up, which I'm pretty happy about. More tears to spin around us. I like that. But yeah, we are we are in a in a good spot now, and I think I think we should be okay for Mr. Beast now. Which I didn't actually mean to call him Mr. Beast in that way. I was just saying, like, the Beast, but Mr. <laughs> and I was like, oh, wait, no. Mr. Beast is already a thing. Mr. Beast is already doing stuff. I've not been using my space bar at all, which is my stupido. Two extra key, thank you. Really should be using it as much as I can. But yeah, this is, this is a cool run. Not quite cool runnings, but it's a cool run. Cool Runnings is a great film. I haven't seen that film in so long, man. Hello, hello, Mr. Red Room. Oh, beautiful. This is why George is a great item. Ooh, this could be very interesting. Okay, it's not as crazy as I thought it'd be, but I like it. I like it. Um, right, I think I'm going to go for this. Just because I've got an idea. Oh, what the fuck? Where the hell did you come from, little fella? Right, one. Two. Three. Four. Five. Could have got some more players out of those double pennies, actually. Six. Oh, there you go. We've got a void. Which is kind of an intriguing one to get. Not really the item I was hoping for, I'll be honest, but intriguing. Yeah, why not? Seems wacky.
Maybe it's only in combat. Okay, there, there it is. Oh my god. This seems like a really, really bad idea. Oh, I love it. I love it. Okay. Let's go. This is this is wacky. This is weird. I do think my tears are lasting less time because of the model rocket, which is annoying, but when we've got this sort of fire rate, it's not like that detrimental. Every 15 shots, it said. Which I don't think... I think it's every 15 times that I shoot. That one also hit us literally immediately, so... We might have to drop this. <laughs> this might not be the greatest of ideas that I've ever had. Especially when we're not getting pennies. Yeah, I'm gonna have to drop this. I was hoping we'd be getting pennies on the regular, but... Game has been mean to us. Another angel deal, baby. Crown of light or golden keys on these bad boys as well. You shouldn't have, game. You shouldn't have. Carry on. Come on, give us an item out of one of these, please. Okay, that is not the item I was hoping for. Why does this item keep showing up? I don't like this item. I don't want it. Taking damage two times in one room applies weakness to all enemies in the room. 20% chance to permanently destroy itself after activating the effect. Okay, that sounds kind of interesting. I guess I'll take it. It's not like a terrible thing to have. I just don't like it as an item. Hello. <sighs> if I could put this active down, this would be great. But I can't. <laughs> And it's gonna end up re-rolling my wooden. Ugh. God damn it, game! Stop giving me active, you fuck! You're such a bitch sometimes. <laughs> You're so rude to me. Right. Anyways, let's keep going. Crown of Light really massively ups the damage we're dealing here. I mean, you can see our tier size has gone up by quite a bit here. Nothing can stop us. Oh, an extra plus one fire rate that makes this floor kind of spicy. Good old godhead, man. Good old godhead. You gotta love it. Oh, we got a library here. Fucking active items, man. <laughs> this is just annoying. Reading book shows a fortune on use. Chance to give 2020 effect for the room. Always gives 2020 when having bookworm. Oh, dang. Um. Yeah, this is just. This is just sad. <laughs> Game keeps giving me. I mean, I, I, I should. Let's start, let's start building up some pennies in there so we can grab the uh, thingies. I will take that, thank you. Oh, what the fuck? I got hit there, apparently. Okay. Quickly bring it back over here. Dude. Come on now. Give us the pennies, please. I just want to put some pennies in this so I can get over the spikes without, like, having to go back and forth constantly. I'd rather do the back and forth early on. Another one. Oh my god, this game's savage sometimes. Just leave it be. Just put the penny on the goddamn floor. Right, anyways, I'm not going to fuck around with that anymore. I'm, I'm getting annoyed. Of course, now it's giving us pennies. Oh, this is just... Godhead's just an unfair item, man. Game has no chance. Never stood a single chance. Ooh, hello. Tainted treasure room. Don't mind if I do. Oh, it's Godhead. Okay, this... What does this do? Damage up, shot speed down, tears down. Tears are surrounded by a static aura that causes enemies uh, within to glow white. Once they glow enough, they are struck by a lightning beam. By a light beam. I don't think this is going to be as good as Godhead, but I'm going to give it a go nonetheless. Was this an error room? Oh, this is some bullshit, man. <laughs> this is some bullshit. Did I even go to my item room? Tears, I need to go away a minute. I'm going to need a card to get out of here, please. Ah, ha, ha. Ah, you cheeky fuckers. You think you're funny, don't you? 
That was pretty good, that. I liked that. I liked that. That was pretty fucking funny. Okay, no, the, the light beam spawns, like, instantly. This is pretty good. I, didn't, I think- I thought it was gonna take a while for the light beam to spawn. It spawns, like, instantly because of the amount of tears. This game, man. Fuck off with the goddamn active items when I already goddamn have one. I started with one. You little creep. Yeah, we've got this absolute swarm of static. It's kind of fitting that we're going to go fight Dogma with this as well. Not like I have enough keys already, thank you. Okay. To the boss we go, wherever the boss is. Yeah, I gotta say, we've been getting hella unlucky at the moment with our uh, setups for... for Active items and stuff. Oh man, this is so annoying. Oh wait, I can't even grab the goddamn book. Because of this fucking dying on hit thing. Okay, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. I can't even grab the book. Little annoying that that happens every time, but... Hey her. I love that because there's so many tears over them, the light beam just instantly strikes. That's what I like to see, baby. Right, can we get another crazy good angel deal? Like, we've been getting lucky with our angel deals thus far, so let's see what happens. Oh my god, the light beams are so strong as well. This might actually be stronger than Godhead was. Oh yeah, it's it's way stronger than Godhead was. We got a devil deal. Interesting. And, oh look, another fucking book. God damn you, game. God damn you. This game is being very disrespectful right now. <laughs> Just active item after active item after active item. The game, it's like, the, the run is good, man. The run is very good. We can't complain about that. But, could you not be so callous? I'm not sure I like this this dying item. It puts you on the floor for way too long. Um, technically, we should go and buy this Glizzy. It does give us plus one in all stats, which is not particularly necessary, but it's, it's good nonetheless. Right. What's in here? Arcade. I'm, I'm really liking this uh, George item that's giving us all these red rooms. Interesting idea, I like it. Um, okay, we need to get a full card from wherever. Make sure we keep an eye out for it. Gotta love these sort of rooms, man. Gotta love these sort of rooms, baby. A room that's entire goal is to just waste your goddamn time. Die, boy. How are you dodging all of this? There you go. Where art thou, rock? A full card variety. I really don't need any more keys. I've got 36 and I've got nothing to spend them on throughout the rest of this run, really. Apart from, like, one item room. Maybe two. Show me where to be, stat. Should take money, just in case. Could get a... Rocking good devil deal, but so far, devil deal, not so hot. I like the way they just, like, glow, glow whiter and whiter until they get hit. Gives you a nice idea of how, how much extra hits you need to get on them. It's funny, like, our actual tears now are lit, like, basically pointless. The, the light beams are really what does all the damage now. The actual tear itself is just, like, it's a vessel in which our light beams attach onto. Item room. Okay. God damn it. We didn't find our full card anyway, so we can't leave yet. Either way. Ah, 
as if that hit me. This is not the thing that annoys me, like, it got hit at the end of a room and I have to sit here and just fire randomly for like six seconds. Let me leave. Right, so we can go and find item room and our full rock. This looks like secret room right here. That it is. That it is. I thought you said weast. <laughs> what? What? Is, what's that from? I thought you said weast. I cannot remember what that's from. Seems like something from like Drake and Josh or something. I don't think it is though. I don't know what it's from. I definitely remember it though. I remember that quote. Oh, really? More bosses with invulnerability phases. I mean, they get destroyed. Oh, and I've accidentally hit myself again here. Oh, what the fuck? Okay, nearly just died to that little shit bit staying alive after I killed the boss there. There is that boss at least. And a rune bag. Hello, hello. Rune bag. I don't know exactly what we can get from rune bag that's going to be super useful. But there's, I mean, I'm sure there's something in there. It can give us some cool soul stones and stuff. Give me soul of golem so I can get like a decent trinket going. Right. Oh, we still didn't find a fucking full card. I'm, I'm like, cool. We're good to go. No, we're not. We're not good to go. Where the hell's our full card at? How have I not seen it yet? It's got to be in one of the rooms that I already went through and just completely ignored, right? I feel like I always do that, so I've got to check. It might be through to the rooms we haven't been to yet. I mean, that's plausible, but the chances of me just having walked past it are probably much, much larger. In fact, they are entirely true, because it can't be in any other room now. So, while I was pro probably while I was talking about where's my fool card, I walked right past it. There it is, yep, right there, look. Walked past that ages ago. Okay. We are Guten to go. Okay. Boss should be super, super easy here. I got how how fucked up is my face right now? Look at this. Eighteen percent chance. Can it happen once again? We've been getting lucky with it thus far. Boom. Dude, it keep that keeps happening. Also, we got lucky again. Let's uh, let's not have it be all active items this time, please. The I mean, quite the steal there. Quite the steal. Right, we're out of this floor. No more devil deals for us. Yeah, devil deals unfortunately very very bad. Uh, angel deals, however, very very good. Right, now we've just got to push our way through and beat the beast. Should be pretty goddamn easy on this run, I'd hope. Yeah, I don't want anything to do with you, Red Block. I see you coming. The only thing is, it can be a little hard to hit the enemy sometimes when our uh, rotating tiers kind of go the wrong way. But luckily, the aura is goddamn huge on them, so... I like to taunt it, but I just... Getting in the way of it, so it thinks it has hope of getting to me, but it doesn't really. Like I said, really can't think of a need for any of the other uh, keys and stuff we're getting here. Feels boss on the map, the boss room um, exit door is also replaced with the treasure room. Size up plus one fire rate. That is literally plus one fire rate, goddamn, okay. That's pretty gnarly. What's what's going on here? Oh. 
Kind of funny that George can give you a red room that gives you another red room. I like that. Yeah, this trinket, I'm wondering how it's going to work on the Ascent. Really? It pushed me into the other room? Fuck you, bomb. Give me that. We realistically should try and find the shop. Wall. Get wrecked, boys. Oh, come on now. Where's the shop at? Don't play me about, game. Don't play me about. Oh, killing those before they get a chance to take flight is a uh, satisfaction on another level. Really? It's every which way apart from the one where I didn't go. Oh my god. <laughs> The light beams, baby. It's the Rapture. I'm surprised there isn't an item. Someone hasn't made a modded item called the Rapture yet. Is that not a thing? That's gotta be a thing, right? That's gotta be something. It'd be weird if, if there was no Rapture item in any of the mod packs. Okay. Um. I guess I might see where the stars. It could be bad for us, but most of the time it's good. We've had some pretty horrible experiences with rickets being one of the items it gave us recently, but other than that, it's not been too detrimental in the past. There we go. Not bad, I guess. Not really necessary, but not bad. Right, boss man. Well, I said boss man. There's no boss actually here. But I, I'm, I'm interested to see how this trinket works in the next floor. Is every single exit going to take me to the treasure room? I spent it. It's gone. Just yeah, get it is. It. <laughs> that's kind of good. <laughs> I don't know how useful that's going to be on every floor, but... That's pretty funny. On some floors, it might end up being a longer trip going to the uh, treasure room, but... I'm willing to give it a go. I'm willing to give it a try. It does it does slightly fuck up my um my navigation in terms of like me knowing where I'm going. But I think in on average it's gonna be a shortcut. Oh wait. This one didn't work because the treasure room's right here. I'll oh, just chill out, keeper, chill out. Good. Okay, yeah, you need to... You need to get holy beamed. <laughs> oh my god. I wonder how quickly this is going to kill the beast, you know. I feel like it could be quite, quite spicy. I feel like it could end up being quite spicy. <laughs> Beautiful, I, I love this. Oh, unfortunately, ain't much we can do about these guys. We just have to hit them five times. Pretty easy for us to get hit by them as well, actually. There you go, dead. Where the hell are we going from? This is where it's bad. I have no idea where we're meant to be going now. Like, I'm guessing this way? Nah. How? I was just about to say, how was I not getting hit there? That would have been ridiculous if I didn't get hit at all there. Thank you for giving my health back. But where are we then? Are we here maybe? Nah. Oh god, that was actually kind of a good shot. Okay, wait for it to spin around again. The static is coming after you. 
Do not worry, it is coming. Have we had anything from Rune back yet? I've not really been paying that much attention, but I don't think we have. Right. Oh, there's there's a rune. There's a rune. I right, see what we got. Algeus, hey, that's actually one of the good ones. And unfortunately, there is some spikes right on the door there. That's kind of uh, a wee wee bit of bullshit right there. People that do that, like people that design rooms with like a spike block one block away from the entrance, are just evil. They just want to see the world burn. Things are dying before they even get a chance to shoot. That's what I like to see. Right. Last floor. Okay, that one was right next door as well. Not very valuable. My god, the, the way it's killing these guys, I'm so excited. Uh, what does this do? Use a random. Oh, it changes color. That's really cool looking. Oh, dude, okay, that, no, 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 I'm going to take some mad damage on this room. Absolutely, I might die on this room. This is, this is, this is a really fucked room, this is. Like, where the hell's the last enemy that I need to kill? Please. Please, where is it? Okay, that was a really fucked room, that was. Because this all the webbing slowing me down, and then him being able to just chase me at full speed while I'm at, like, half speed. God damn, that was scary. I was like, we could die in this room. I was going to have to pop algas. And then we got diggers. <laughs> Amy, ghosts in my ascent. I like some of the room names here. Yeah, get out of here, you. Unfortunately, this time around, we went all types of the wrong way. There you go. We got through it. Let's see how quickly we beast on the uh, on the ascent here. On the home floor. Ooh, hello. A few burn bags. Not bad. Another algis. I mean, technically, can't I do this? If I put that there, and then go and grab this algis, does that let me have two? Maybe? I don't know if that'll work. I don't know if it'll disappear when I sleep. Because it's technically like a different room, right? Ooh, that's very nice in addition. I mean, it's obviously not super useful, but... Because of our luck, but... Okay, it is still there. Nice. Good to know that I can do that. Golden Trinkets Plus. Um, one second, I need to click this message for more. I don't know why our tears have now gone purple. Well, they weren't purple before, were they? Oh, it's... It's me v you. On the Godhead Sphere. I'm going to pop one of my allergies as soon as this guy's ready to go. Just because I'm not going to be able to save it, am I, sir? So. I need to make sure I get the other one, though, before he dies. Shit. He's not actually dying as quick as I thought he would. He's dying quick, but, like, he's got to be way faster. The fire rate and stuff we've got going on. Allergies will run out any second, but I think we killed him. There you go. Beautiful stuff. These guys, the the um, the sins, should go down real fast. No, no, not as quick as I would have thought. Thing is, as well, once we get hit, we lose half our damage on our first hit. It's very hard to see what's going on right now. I have to say. I mean, the guy, they're dying fast, but I would have thought it was a bit quicker than this, to be honest. It's really, really hard to dodge shots like this. I basically just can't see myself at all times. Yeah, 
y'all y'all little friends are gonna be uh gonna be gone in an instant. Yeah, we're, we're killing him pretty quick, actually. Like realistically, he only got one of his poison shots off, and then he's about to perish. The good thing is as well, we can always like chain up a bunch of shots ready for when the next boss comes in. So now we've got tons of shots ready. He comes in. And we just... I was going to say we wreck him, but he took forever to arrive. That was kind of annoying, actually. I lost my holy mantle for no good reason there. Oh my god, I didn't even get a single bomb out. Okay, this is quick. Oh, dude. Okay. Bit mean. <gasps> I want that. Smelt me a trinket, baby. Pretty easy to make a hole for myself when I just destroy all of the, uh, the scythes instantly. I don't know what I actually smelted, you know. I wasn't I wasn't paying attention. I don't even know where it came from. I'm guessing it was like a random on hit effect from um Baptism, whatever it's called. Milk of Baphomet, that's what it's called. Oh my god. <laughs> It's just this ball of static. Static and missiles is all we know. Oh my god. Okay, we can't light beam the, uh, the stalagmites and stalactites. Unfortunately, sir. To be fair, actually, nugget bombs here are going to be pretty good. Good damage from the bombs themselves. What's going on right now? Okay. I don't know what's going on, so I had to pop allergies because I'm, like, stuck inside him. Can we end this charade, please? Thank you. You know the speed I'm on isn't helping. It's very hard to actually get out of the way of these stalagmites and stuff. Also, loads of my goddamn pooters aren't doing anything, which is... Also very annoying. Get out of bombs now. Okay, there you go. Nice and easy. We did it. Hope you guys enjoyed that one. And yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one.